All right, here we go. The last sample final exam question, question 12 on the Chem 110A sample final. What is the empirical formula of a compound that contains chromium and oxygen only? A 1.500 gram sample contains 1.03 grams of chromium. Okay, not too bad. If we know that 1.500 grams contains chromium and oxygen, okay? Chromium is Cr and oxygen is O. And we also know that 1.3 grams is chromium. Does it not therefore tell us that the difference between those are 0. Um, 47 grams. Oh, that's 1.03. That's right. 0 0.47 grams is oxygen. Well, sure. If 1.03 grams is chromium, the rest has to be oxygen to get 1.5 grams. And once we know the masses of each, it's real easy to get the empirical formula. You just multiply by 1 over the molar mass for each. 1 mole over 16 grams for oxygen. And real quick look. There's chromium. Element number 24 has a molar mass of 52 grams per 1 mole. And you remember oxygen. 16. Yeah. There, that's better. 16 grams per 1 mole. Okay. So that's where those values come from. We do the calculation. 1.03 divided by 52, 0.0198 moles, and 0.47 divided by 16 is 0 0.0294 moles. All right, now we have to divide by the smallest one, do the normalizing step. And we get one chromium to one point four eight oxygens, which is close enough to one to two ratio that we multiply both by two gives us CR two of those and one point four eight times two is three oxygens. And that means we write the formula as Cr2O3. And that's it. So, you know where you're going to go. That's chapter 8. End of chapter. And that should be what you want to get done. Okay, good luck.